management of trichotillomania is highly dependent on how severe it is and, um, and the age of the patient. Of course, we have experts who train um, uh, patients on uh, cognitive uh, behavioral therapy and help stop or manage that urge to really pull their hair. We have other things um, like key of triggers like TV or reading. We request patients to make sure that their hair is covered and make it just a little bit difficult for you to access your hair. There are other coping mechanisms. If you're going through a very stressful period or you have, you have anxiety and you're in the office, we, we ask patients to use things like the stress ball and that helps to take away the urge as well as keep your hands a little bit busy. In kids, we just have to encourage patients to keep observing what's happening. If they are watching TV or they are eating or they are reading, can we cover their scalps and, and their hair to make sure that we make it a little bit difficult uh, for them to access. So it might be quite difficult to stop overnight, but there are quite a number of um, therapies that can be done. There is anxiety medication that can help to re reduce the anxiety hence reducing the, the, the urge to pull your hair. If someone is going through stress, there are quite a number of ways to manage the stress. And then um, just basically coping mechanisms uh, to make sure that you manage um, the pulling of the hair and avoid getting into severe situations where um, you will end up having uh, trichobezoas.